Hello everybody, I want to show you with this video how you can transfer data from the internal storage to the micro SD card at the Samsung Galaxy A72. So for that we will need the built-in file explorer. So for that just swipe up like this and then you will have here the Samsung folder. So and if you tap on the Samsung folder we have an app named My Files. So. On that app, we have, we have at first a nice overview with the recent files and we have categories here. You know? We have um, our images, videos, audios and so on. We have it already automatically arranged. And a bit below, we have the internal storage and the SD card here. Okay, then let's start to transfer something. Uh, let's go here to the internal storage. And um, I would recommend to you if you want to save some data that you transfer at first pictures and videos and so on. And these pictures and videos of the camera you will always find it here at the DCI M folder. And then go here on camera and here are all your pictures and videos from your camera. Okay, so just hold your finger on the file you want to transfer that it's marked like this. And then you can also mark if you want some other ones or if you want to select them all, no, we want to have space then let's go here on all and now all our files are marked. Okay, now you have the opportunity to move them directly to the um, SD card or to copy them, to just copy them as is for the safety and so on. But I would recommend to you, um, because we want to have space to go on move. So, and now we go back. You can also go here on the folder with the house and then go to the point SD card. So uh, now I'm here on my SD card and as, as you can see, um, I have uh, prepared already something. I have already some uh, uh, folders here, but you can also, also if your uh, SD card is empty, I would recommend to you to create a new folder. Um, then just go here on the three points here at the corner and you can create here a new folder um, and name it pictures or something like this to uh, put your files there. And uh, yeah, I've created your already a DCIM folder uh, with the camera and so on. And then finally, if I'm in the folder I, I want to have my pictures in, I just go on move here and the pictures I've marked before are now directly here in my folder. Yeah, let me go back again to the internal storage. Uh, the same thing I've shown you with files, you can do as well with folders, of course. No? So you can mark some folders like the complete DSCIM folder, like the download folder and so on, like the music folder and, and so on. And you can do the same thing, go also on move to transfer it then to the SD card. And yeah, but with the folders, you should take care that you don't transfer operating system data because then your phone doesn't, well, um, doesn't work well anymore. So just transfer data or folders with data like uh, documents, you know, PDF files and so on, or videos, pictures, uh, music files, MP3 and so on. And yeah, okay, that's it. I want to show you also something else. Um, so if you have insert your SD card for the very first time, he's asking you also if you want to change the location of the storage for your SD card. And I would recommend to you to go here on change because then all your future pictures will go directly to the SD card and that saves also time to do this process we have seen before all the time. So if you want to double check it if it's really um, the, uh, 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 the SD card you can go here on the settings and scroll down a bit and then you will have here the storage location and you can choose if you want to have the internal storage or the SD card. Yeah, I hope I could help you with this video and answer your question. And uh, yeah, maybe if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me something that would be very helpful for my videos. Uh, thank you so, so much for. And I've created also some other videos if you're interested in, may like tips and tricks uh, for this phone and so on. Or if you want, you can also subscribe me uh, if you haven't done it before. It would be really a pleasure. Uh, to see you again and yeah thank you so so much for your support and maybe until next time ciao